Hey everybody, how you doing? Uh, you might remember a while back I made a video about Log Me In program, the one that lets you connect to your computer from anywhere else in the world, basically. Uh, it's just a remote program. Uh, somebody brought it to my attention about this other program, and it's called Team Viewer. And it actually, that's a pretty decent program too. It works really good and it's, it's a lot easier to connect and it's uh, a little simpler program, not as many gadgets and buttons to push. Uh, but I've changed a lot of my customers over to that program because I fix a lot of my customers from right here in my office. Because most of the time when your computer goes down, it's a software issue. And it's just a matter of going in and reprogramming your system or whatever you have to do. And you can be back up and running in a couple hours instead of taking it to a repair shop where it's down for two weeks and, you know, you, um, people worry about their security and their privacy and their files and stuff. And uh, with this program, you know, I mean, you take it to a, a repair shop and you don't know what they're doing with your files. And a lot of times when you get it back to say it was infected with too many viruses and it's wiped out and you didn't get a chance to save all your pictures and documents and stuff. And then that runs into a costly program to retrieve all your data. And uh, I do that too for my customers. If, if they've lost their data like that, then I retrieve their data. Um, and, and I can also do that remotely. Uh, but I wanted to make this video and show you how to install this software and how to use it for yourself. You know, if you're away on vacation or something like that, you want to connect to your computer at home. You've got the software installed. You connect right to your computer in a matter of seconds and you got all your email and everything and your documents. Right now. I hope you're all doing great and enjoy the video. And uh, I'll talk to you later. I was going to say I'm going to make a video before the holidays, but I can't promise nothing. I mean, it's already the holidays, so I'm going to be before Christmas. So uh, take it easy. You click on that link in the video description, it's going to take you to this page. Click on download. Big green button, download now, it's free. Save the file. Pretty small. I saved mine to my desktop. Double click on that, choose run. You want to install the program. Use next, you want to personal use, non-commercial use, accept both agreements. Now at this point you can start automatically with Windows, you can put your own password in here. If you leave it on normal installation it gives you a different password every time. Click finish. Team Viewer will start. Shows up down here. You right click. Go into Options. Shows you your password. You can change it there. Remote Control is, I set it for custom settings on high and almost the highest quality, optimized quality on fast servers. Uh, the default setting for this is optimized quality. And usually it's way too slow. You get really crappy pictures in it. Don't change anything else in here. Uh, click OK. Okay, you double click on the Team Viewer icon, and it'll bring up the number for your machine. If you have it installed on another working computer, type in this number type it in here and it'll connect you to this computer from anywhere in the world okay, so you open your team viewer now if you have this installed on another computer you type in the number of that computer or connect the partner it asks you for the password mm -hmm. And you logged in. This is my surveillance system. Minimize. We got 
the whole computer. You're controlling that computer. You know, a typical remote session, if I'm working on it, uh, things can move pretty fast and you, you don't see you know, so many windows opening and closing. Well, this program lets you actually record the remote session and then you can go back at your leisure and play it back at your own speed and you can see everything that was done to fix your computer. So actually, the next time it breaks on you, you can review that, that video and walk through some of those steps and see if that fixes it for you. So it's, it's got a real good benefit to it.